for us to cross over to the city of Kisumu where Wycliffe Okech okay, is about to give us an update on how the situation was. Remember in the morning it was a very chaotic situation but somehow um, you can see some calmness in the background. But first of all let's listen in uh, to what uh, Wycliffe is about to share with us. Wycliffe if you can hear me check it out. A very good afternoon to you, Brian Kimani, back in Nairobi. Of course, it has been hours of action here in the lakeside city of Kisumu since about uh, 10 a.m. You remember the last time we came to you live from the these very streets. I had totally updated you that since morning between around 7 and 10, it was, it was a generally a peaceful demonstration that uh, there was a crowd marching from Kondele coming towards town. But then uh, when they got to where we are right now this is uh, Kisumu boys uh, round about the intersection point between uh, the Kisumu Kakamega highway and of course uh, uh, Nairobi road this is uh, the point where uh, you can even see uh, the police officers are still seated here actually where uh, from 10 all through to 12 and uh, even through to 1, there was uh, it was uh, a chaotic uh, uh, run-ins between uh, the police and uh, the locals here. Of course, uh, since that time, they uh, from, from from 10 uh, from 10 they tried to access uh, the state lodge, which is of course a guarded area. But then uh, the police uh, they barricaded that road and lobbed uh, tear gas canister actually to disperse uh, the crowds, which dispersed into various uh, uh, directions. Of course, and uh, the police have done within the can, all that they can to keep the crowd from the uh, CBD here and you can see just right behind me here this is a uh, uh Kisumu Kakamega um, Highway, which is the road, the road leading all through to Kondele. That crowd, the crowd from uh, in Kondele, that uh, usually charges from Kondele coming to town, has been contained at another roundabout up there called uh, uh, Patels, and that is where the police are also managing that area just to ensure that that crowd doesn't uh, get access to the CBD here. And even where we are right now, this is uh, the inter intersection point. Uh, actually, the the, uh, the road coming from, uh, uh, as you can see, my colleague uh, Koreshin is showing you that is the Nairobi Road, which is actually also read to a, a place called Nyalenda. Nyalenda is also uh, uh an estate where which which tends to be the gathering point for the protesters here and now the police are just uh, keeping uh, uh, coordinating this area off uh, to ensure that the crowd there does and also actually access uh, the uh, cbd here and of course uh, since uh, for the last three hours it has actually 